What's happening, my beautiful people? Hoody hoo! We've got a tutorial. We're looking at the drag back. This skill move, similar to the body faint, was reduced heavily from FIFA 15, but post patch, they revamped it. Back on the main page. Getting the type of exposure it deserves. Wow. Do you want to see more tutorials? Drop a thumbs up. Also, let me know in the comments. Which should I do next? Maybe another skill move that's been upgraded? What do you think? What do you think? Yo, team of the year is knocking at the front and the back door. And if you need cheap, safe, and reliable coins, Dirty will get you that discount. FIFA Coins Zone links are in the description. Wait for it. Are you more into buying FIFA points? You want a better deal? What? G2A will hook that up. Dirty will get you that discount. Let's get it started. No black eyed peas. We're heading into the controls and we're going to my backyard, the arena. This needs to become your best friend. If you want to be a skiller, you want to practice some long shots, even some free kicks, or get involved in the skill games. And this is a universal skill. Anyone and everyone on the pitch can execute a drag back and make your opposition. Whoo, we could quiver in his boots just a tad bit. And if you're on the PlayStation, you're holding R1. If you're on the Xbox, you're holding RB. And I've got the key to success. It's not GJ Khaled Snapchat. No, no, as we head into Dragon. In order to execute a drag back, it says push down on the left analog stick. And that is entirely true. That will work for you. I promise that that is good money. However, it's harder to learn that sometimes. And what I'm thinking when I'm playing in a match, I need to make sure that I'm turning in the opposite direction that I'm facing. Because the 180 degree drag back is the most effective, the most efficient, and it gives you the most space to work with. So why would you want to do any other drag back? As we have the double drag, one is good, two is always going to be better. At least that's what I've been trying to preach with the ladies, right? Oh, another poor reference point. Just let that go. Let that go. But the double drag back is something everyone should have because it can get you out of trouble. Uh, not if you're going to be arrested. This will not help you. But in, in FIFA, it can get you out of trouble. It backs out of traps. If someone's trying to hit you with a double team and you drag back out of that deal, it's very deceptive in terms of skill moves. It might be the most deceptive skill move we have in FIFA 16. It's the equivalency to a crossover in bas basketball. I've never seen a skill make your opponents look so bad in this year's installment. And now the advanced drag back is something I get asked about a lot. So we're going to hit a freeze frame and we've got to talk about it. So, with the advanced drag, I call it the what the hell skill move because it's unlisted. It, it really is. So, you're going to do a drag back just like normal. You're going to pull it back identical. However, right when you see the drag back animation has started, your player is starting to pull back the ball, then you push forward instead of back. You're going to push forward on the left analog stick instead of back. This is one of the very few skill moves where you can change it in the middle of the skill move. And a lot of people ask about the advanced drag back, and it is advanced. It's something that you're going to be able to do after you've mastered the regular drag back. But it should be something you have in your arsenal. It takes some space. It confuses people. It freezes your opponent. I like it a lot. And a lot of people don't know how to do it, which is even better. You're going to get some hate messages all day, every day. you got cheat codes. And then with the final two examples, I wanted to cover a couple different combinations. So the drag back plus the ball roll, two effective skills, put them into one package. And you've got yourself Direct TV as well as Xfinity Internet with no Comcast issues. All right, we've got no Comcast problems. And then the Vegas drag, we're looking at the roulette. You see the combo right there, right? Right? And what makes this such a nice special package is because the drag back is a little bit slow and the roulette is pretty quick. At least in this year's uh, title, it is a little bit of a quicker move. So you can put them to sleep and then wake them up. Thanks again for watching. I'm actually going to leave you guys with some of the tutorial clips that didn't make it into the video because I like to showcase goals not always hitting the post or the ones that damn near connected and as always we've got the social media icons just above me just above me you know stay connected but I have a lot more content coming for you ASAP ASAP <laughs>